Hi guys, hope you're all okay. Today I've got a food haul for you, slightly different from normal because I'm having two deliveries today um, from two different companies. The first will be the Cornish Food Market. Um, as the name suggests, it is a Cornwall based um, service and it most of their stuff is, is from Cornwall. Um, obviously like to buy local as often as we can. However, they don't really, I can't personally do a full food shop with them. Um, so I have also got a delivery coming from Iceland, which mostly does frozen food, as the name suggests. Okay, and the Cornish Food Market delivery has came. Um, one of the things I do love about them, they do very minimal packaging. Also, if you use them like weekly or fortnightly, they will collect these boxes for you so you don't have to just get rid of them yourself. Um, so yeah, let's uh, show you what I got. So one of the first things I'm noticing is I've got the West Country Food Lover. This isn't something I ordered, this is a freebie. But it's called your home cooking companion. This looks really nice actually. I'm quite looking forward to going through that. Okay. So, I've got some organic lizard leaves. They're called lizard leaves because there's a place in Cornwall called the lizard and this is where they're grown. I've got some Cornish milk. I ordered skimmed. They've sent me semi-skimmed. I can live with that. I've got some lovely Cornish potatoes. They smell good. So yeah, they look really nice. Some big chunky bits of Cornish broccoli. Everything's a little bit, because it is fresh, do you know what I mean? This stuff is super duper fresh, so it's wet where they've cleaned it this morning for me. Um, a baby cucumber. <laughs> a courgette. Some Cornish clotted cream. Some local eggs. Asda and Tesco's now sell these. Well, they do down here. I don't know if they do them across the country, but as to do sell these now but you've been able to get this brand of eggs from the Cornish food market for a while now. A big bag of Cornish lettuce, there's another baby cucumber there. Over to this box, this is what their branding looks like, Cornish food market. They do these things called a barbecue pack and it comes with two burgers, two chops and there's two sausages, it's really yummy. And again, that is a local butcher's, this is local meat. <laughs> so I believe, yeah, I got, I thought I got two of those, maybe I only got one. Okay, so I got some rump steak, they look nice, again, Cornish. Some lovely looking local sausages. And then this one is some lamb steak. Yum. And I can open up the bag. Okay, so here's the second barbecue pack that I got exactly the same. We've got some chicken thighs and some bacon bits, this stuff is great for quiche and risotto and things, you just need to like cut it up and break it down yourself. And then hogs pudding, um, this is a Cornish thing, um, some places call it white pudding, it's in Cornwall it's called hogs pudding, it is yummy. And then I've got another packet of sausages, and then... We've got a nice Berryman's white loaf. It's got a bit squished in delivery, but you know, we can deal with that. Some fruit scones, they look very yummy. And a medium steak pasty for me, and a large steak pasty for John. The other great thing I want to show you about this company, and, and really I think this kind of stands when you're always buying local, is look at the dates you're getting on this. like. This meat is used by the 3rd of August. This is the 14th of August. Basically because this has all been prepared in the last couple of days. Whereas when you go to Tesco's or Asda or any main supermarket, you know, it's been killed 
it's been sent to a factory. It's sat in the factory for how many days? It's been prepped and wrapped in a factory, then transported all over the country to the supermarket's head office. Then it's dispatched from there to all the other stores. And that's why when you buy meat at Asda or Tesco's or Sainsbury's or anywhere, you get like three days, five days if you're lucky. But yeah, super good dates on this stuff because it's all just come from down the road. Okay, and the Iceland's shopping has just been delivered. John's come home from work and he brought me these beautiful flowers. So that's how they're all of a sudden on the table. They didn't come from Iceland's. <laughs> they are gorgeous. But yes, what the Iceland man brought, I got two bottles of Diet Pepsi, a vinegar, I got some flavoured water. This is strawberry and raspberry flavoured water. And I got a soft and gentle deodorant. Fruit wise, I got a bag of pears, um, a bag of bananas, some red seedless grapes, and they had 50% fruit on the strawberries, so we got some of those. I've got a tin of baked beans with pork sausages cheeky packet of chocolate biscuits some crumpets some Muller light Greek style yoghurt some breaded turkey a multi pack of crisps which has been a little bit crushed um, some unsmoked back bacon there's two of those and then didn't get a whole lot of frozen, but what we did get, um, wanted to try some of these. This is the Slimming World Ready Meal, so we got two of the Chicken Tikka. They were really high reviewed on the Iceland's website. And then two of the Singapore Noodles, because again, they had good reviews on the website. Got some of these cocktail sausages. The boys normally have one each chopped up into their breakfast. Um... If you're new to this channel, by boys I mean my dogs. Um, got some mini chicken fillets and two packs of fruit splits. And all of that together, including delivery, was £83, which I think is a really good price for two weeks shopping. Um, so yes, we will be doing meals of the week this week. So if you want to see this food in action, stay tuned to the channel. Uh, if you've liked this video, please give me a thumbs up, comment, subscribe, share, and I will talk to you all very soon. Bye, guys.